A critical new warning from the DEA. It's sounding the alarm on a new method drug cartels are using to sell highly addictive and potentially deadly fentanyl, making it look just like candy, bright and colorful, to better target young Americans. And here to discuss is Steve Carlton. He's executive clinical director of Gallus Medical Detox Centers, and he specializes in fentanyl treatment. Steve, thanks for taking the time. First, I want to get your reaction to what we just showed and this new warning. These drugs, they, they truly look like candy. They do, Anna. The, the fentanyl that we're seeing on the streets now has primarily been blue, and now we're starting to see these colorful pills show up on the street. And the DEA has told us that there's no difference in the contents of these pills from the, the old fentanyl pills that we've been seeing, other than their packaging and clearly marketing to uh, kids and adolescents. Explain what makes fentanyl so, so, so dangerous. It's primarily it's the the potency and the concentration. If you if you think about your uh, a sweetener packet in a coffee shop, uh, that amount of fentanyl is enough fentanyl to kill six people. So when we talk about fentanyl, it's it's a tiny amount it can be deadly. We know overdose deaths are on the rise nationwide. Uh, in fact, overdose deaths in 2021 from April to April topped. 100,000 for the first time ever. I'm curious, where does fentanyl fit into the bigger picture when it comes to drug overdoses? So it's been, the opiate crisis has been going on since 1999. And, and we saw a steady rise in opiate deaths and opiate overdoses. And in 2015, since then, it's been an exponential increase. And when you look at that 108,000 people, what we know is uh, nearly two thirds of those involved fentanyl. So fentanyl is the driving force behind um, this this deadly uh, overdose rate that we're seeing right now. And so if, if there's this effort to really lure in younger people, what should parents mm -hmm. be looking out for? And what signs are there in someone using fentanyl? I think the, the, the telltale sign that somebody is using fentanyl is, is pinpoint pupils. Your pupils um, are just a small dot. And, and you notice a lot of drowsiness, although mood can range from anything from euphoria to, to a deep state of depression. More than anything, what you want to look out for in your loved ones is, is a dramatic change in behavior. Most of addiction is driven by uh, people struggling with mental health, people that have experienced a significant trauma. Uh, people that are having chronic pain or some other type of medical condition. That's typically what drives these things. Steve Carlton, thank you so much for sharing your expertise with us and offering some real pertinent information, vital, potentially life-saving information today. Appreciate it. Thank you, Anna. If you or a loved one is struggling, there is help. Just dial 988 to connect directly to the Suicide and Crisis Lifeline, and you can also call 888 306-3122 to connect with the team Steve works with specifically at Gallus Medical Detox Centers.